it the earth, be it the ocean, be it the trees, be it the animals, be it insan, be it the jinn, be it the prophets, be it the angels, be it Jibreel, be it... Baby, you can call me a superman Chucho tell to take any to go come Welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fadi Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe if you're new. Like I said, my name is Fanny, my partner is Jesse, and we also have a vlogging channel called Fanny and Jesse 2.0. So make sure to subscribe. You can check us on Patreon, diving in with Fanny and Jesse. Thank God I said it right for the second time. And yeah, you can also support us on Patreon, Fanny and Jesse. All the links are in the description below and yeah just make sure to check them out i hope you guys are all right and thank you for supporting us thus far and a big shout out to the person that actually um suggested this video i'm very excited to be reacting to this because there's always something new i'm hearing always something new i'm learning always something to take out of these videos that we actually do so yeah, I'm very, very excited and I hope you guys are keeping yourselves safe and I hope you're just in good health and are just doing fine. Yeah. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Subhanal. Subhanal. Listen to the ocean. Listen to the waves crushing. Look up. Look at the creation of Allah Azza wa Jal. Look at the billions of grains of sand that you are sitting on. And look at the trees that surround us. All of his creation. Be it the earth. Be it the ocean. Be it the trees. Be it the animals. Be it insan. Be it the jinn. Be it the prophets. Be it the angels. Be it Jibreel. Be it Israfil. Everything is dead. Except Allah Azza wa Jal. Everything is dead. Everything is dead. Except Allah Azza wa Jal. Nothing moves. Nothing stops. Nothing makes. And nothing breaks. Except by His will. His creation is perfect. His Nabi is perfect. His Deen is perfect. His Rahmah is perfect. My brothers, his punishment is perfect. On the day of judgment, when all of man, from Adam to the last of them, will stand in front of Allah Azza wa Jal, and all of the jinn, they will stand in front of Allah Azza wa Jal on a day that is 50,000 years long. The sun will be a mile on top of your heads and we will be drowning in our own sweats. And Allah Azza wa Jal will call. He will call for Nara Jahannam to be brought forward. He will call upon the angels to bring forward hellfire. Picture this. Picture this. 70,000 ropes. Each rope has 70,000 angels. That's 4.9 billion. 4.9 billion angels. And they will drag Nur Jahannam forward. They will bring it as they have been commanded. They will bring it forward. And we will be watching. We will be watching. When Nur Jahannam sees the disbelievers and the sinners for the first time, it will burst in anger. It will burst in anger such a sound that the 4.9 billion angels will let go of the ropes 
when it sees the disbelievers and the sinners for the first time. Allah Azza wa Jal says in the Quran that everything, everything, man, jinn, and angels, when our Jahannam will pass, everything will fall to its knees. Everything will fall to its knees. But that's not the scary thing. Allah Azza wa Jal is promising Nar Jahannam that you will be full. I will fill you up. Halim Talakti, he says to it. Are you full? Is there any more room? And it says to him, Almin Mazid, bring it on. Is there any more? Is there any more? This is what I was designed for. This is what I was created for. Bring them on. Is there any more? Allah is perfect in everything He does. He is perfect in His creation. He is perfect in His Rahmah. And He is perfect in His, in his punishment. Oh, you who believe, save yourselves and your families from hellfire. Its fuel will be men and stones. Do not delay. This is the time. I really don't know what's wrong with my laptop, but it's like... For some reason it feels like it needs to stop somewhere it's always disturbing my reactions but anyway i hope it doesn't spoil anything when editing so yeah um it's really if someone doesn't worry when they watch something like this talking about hell then maybe you have a problem imagine these places when saying is there is there more like how big is this place how many sinners are out there? How many wrong, wrongdoers are out there? How many disbelievers are out there? And this place has been specifically created for that purpose. To, to hold people that I've just mentioned. Non-believers, sinners, um, wrongdoers, you name it. But at the end of the day, those that can save themselves save yourselves like he narrated if you can save yourself you can also save another person if you can come to the realization that maybe there's only one god and maybe i should do this and maybe i should be righteous then you can also teach the other person or show the other person next to you that this is possible you can do the right thing you can believe you can do good you don't have to be doing criminal activities or wrong activities or bad activities that affect other people. But we together can stand, we can unite together and actually do good, bring out good in this world and actually save more people to avoid this hell that's this crime. So yeah, let me just, let me know what you guys actually think about this specific video. By the way, I was reacting to Jahannam. Hellfire brother Muhammad Hopeless. I think I reacted to him last week, if not the week before. And yeah, a big shout out to the person that actually suggested this. I'm very, very happy you brought this to my attention. And it was really an interesting video to watch. So let me know what you think about this video. I'm, I'm curious to always hear what you guys have to say, your views and everything else. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends. And of course, do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next reaction video.